Hi guys, so in today's video I'm going to be doing my very first plan with me, so I haven't quite worked out the mechanics on how to do this yet, so please ignore if things are out of focus or out of shot and there's shadows and stuff. This is my first time doing this, but today I want to do a plan with me for the week of March 28th, which actually is tomorrow. Sorry, you're going to see shadows from my hands. Um, I've never done one of these and I wanted to give it a shot and try and start doing these on my channel because I'm a huge planner girl. I love planning. It helps keep me super organized and I thought I would try one out. So the kit I'm going to be using is this vintage floral kit from Oh Hello Stationery Co. that I recently hauled a couple of weeks ago. Um, there's three sheets. So you have this functional sheet, the sheet of half boxes, and then there's a sheet of full boxes. So I'm going to be using this in addition to some other stickers to mark some important things that are happening in my week. So the, I think the first thing I'm going to do is put down my weekend banner. If I can do it without ripping the sticker, because we all know that can be. This one is just not cooperating. But it kind of ripped a little, but that's okay. We're going to make it work. And we're going to put that right here. So there's my weekend banner. Um, so now I think I'm going to do all of the full boxes and since I'm using the horizontal planner I like to put the full boxes in these squares on the side here so I'm going to do that and I'm just going to kind of, because I have a lot of these so I'm just going to go ahead and kind of put them wherever And they fit these perfectly in the horizontal. So you can use vertical kits in the horizontal planner um, if you choose to. Because a lot of shops don't make horizontal kits because they're just not as popular. But I think my next planner, I'm definitely going to invest in the Erin Condren vertical. Just because, I mean, I like horizontal planning. But the options for stickers are just so much better with the vertical ones that... I think I'm going to do that. So that side's done. I'm just going to flip this over. This is the April side. April 1st is on Friday. So I'm going to use a row of these full boxes that come with the kit. You get a ton of these, so I'm going to put these down. Let's see if I can find which ones. Looks like they're all pretty much the same so I think I know which ones I'm going to use and I chose this kit because I thought it matched these colors nicely and the one thing that really like I don't know irks me and I don't know if it bothers anybody else is that on the weeks where the months cross over Aaron Condren decided to use two different colors so it's kind of hard to match your planning but that's just me These ones weren't super even, but oh well. I'm not one of those people where everything has to be perfect. Okay, so all my full boxes are down. The next thing I'm going to do is put in one of these holiday markers for April Fool's Day. And I'm going to put that guy, I guess, right here. It's not perfect, but that's okay. So we're going to flip this back over and do Monday. On Monday, I'm going to use this heart checklist. And I think I'm going to do a personal sticker like that because these don't exactly match, but that works. We're gonna do a house sticker. Um, I'm gonna use one of these. One of these. This is one of their house sticker sets. I think I'm gonna use this red one to mark this. Go like that. And then I'm also gonna take a sticker from this Happy Planner set that says Big Day. And I'm gonna put that. I guess. I don't know where to put this. Maybe right here. I guess on top, why not? We're actually closing on our house Monday. So you're gonna see me go in frame for this because I just don't have any other way to avoid it. We have our final walkthrough. And 
at 9, then we have to go to the get, I'm just going to write bank check, and then we just have our closing. I'll zoom you guys in a little bit so you can see. The camera doesn't want to zoom anymore. That's all right. Um, so we have the final walkthrough. Our, we have to get the bank check, and then we have the closing. So we're just going to do that. Um, the 31st, I'm actually going to use... I'm going to do a check mark here. And I'm going to do a half box. And Thursday is March 31st, so it is the end of no spend. I did a no spend for the month, month of March. I mentioned it on my blog. So we're going to put that there to notate it that I can finally start buying stickers again, which I can't wait. That's really all I know for the beginning of the week. I don't really know anything for Tuesday or Wednesday at this point. So we're going to flip over to this, the latter part of the week. Saturday is my sister's bridal shower. Um, I don't know if I have any bridal stickers. So I'm trying to see if I have something. that I could use some sort of a reminder sticker. Let's use this hack box. We're going to layer it on the full box and we're going to label it Emily Shower. And let's see if I can find a checklist somewhere. Something to notate. Hmm, that one doesn't have anything. And like I said, my first plan with me ever, normally I just post these on Instagram, so just bear with me trying this out for the first time. Do any of these have checklists? I guess this one will work. You can use that sticker. It's from one of these Happy Planner sticker sets. I highly recommend these. They're super cheap. And you can get them at, um, like, Michael's. So I'm just going to write on here, set up 10 shower. And then, I don't know, payment. And now that I remember it, I'm just going to put a little flag on Tuesday and just write mall because we might be going to the mall Tuesday. Um, What else should I do? I think I'm also going to put Friday is going to be payday. So I have these payday stickers from, where's the shop card? Because I can't remember where these are from. They are from a shop called Twice as Nice Lettering on Etsy. So I'm going to put one of these down on Friday. And I'm going to use one of the green ones. We get paid bi-weekly, so I like these stickers to remind me that it's payday. And I have a ton of these, so we're going to do that. Let's see. I do have these wedding stickers from her also, so maybe I'll try and use one of these for Saturday. Let's see here. What do I think will fit? I probably can use the rings. Her, these are matte stickers, so maybe... Like that? Yeah, that'll work. That's pretty. Um, 
I need to get my eyebrows waxed this week, so maybe I'll put one of these stickers on maybe third, I don't know. Something to remind myself of. Maybe I'll put them over here. These are from a shop called Hip Digi Chick. I thought these were super cute. They're owls with giant um, eyelashes to remind you to get your eyelashes waxed. I think I'll do that. Oh, also on Monday over here, we, we're not working Monday, so I think I'll put down a no work sticker and I'm gonna use one of the, this is from Sweet Quiet Design. I think I'm gonna use this green one. Maybe here to kind of go with the spread. Oh, I need to put another half box on Monday. And I'm going to put on here measure tape. Because we need to measure for our washer and dryer at the final walkthrough. So I'm going to put that on here just as a reminder to bring a measuring tape with us. Let's layer that, I guess. And I think the only other thing I was going to put down is a hydrate sticker and my habit trackers. So I'm going to pull those out of my accordion. So I have the Oh Hello Stationery Co. Hydrate stickers. I'm gonna put one of these down in the notes section. It's gonna go right over it, I guess. Put that right there to track my water. And let's do, here are their habit trackers. I really, really like these. I'm gonna use this light green And I think I'm gonna use this muted yellow. Put those next to each other. And I'm gonna say, I'm gonna flip this over. We're gonna put in workout. And we're going to do shake ology. Make sure I'm actually drinking my shakes every day and not blowing them off like I have been. I'm not really sure. Let's see. Let's do another half box. I'm going to put it over here as well in the notes section. And we are going to put in M7 D1 work. I'm currently doing a master's degree and that is the module for the week so I'm just going to make sure I remember to do that work. I usually do that on Sundays. What else? I feel like there's something else I need to put on the first. And I'm not remembering it. I went in to grab a sticker. And now I cannot remember for the life of me what I was going to grab. Hmm. What was it? I don't remember. Pay no attention to the noises in the background. My neighbors are very irritating. Oh, we're going to do a donate clothes because I have lots of clothes I need to get rid of. So we're going to put this little guy down here. That's another Oh Hello sticker. They're one of my favorite shops, if you couldn't tell. I get a lot of my stickers from them. You know, I think that's everything that I'm going to do for this spread. I'm just going to put all this stuff in here. And yeah, 
that's going to be the spread for the week. So as you guys can tell, I don't really care that much about no white space. Um, I'm usually a very simplistic planner. This is about as much as I do. I'm going to do another video after this. I'm going to do a flip through of March just so you can see the different spreads I did. But I think that's going to be it for this video. Uh, I'm probably going to film a couple more and have them go up over the next two weeks because we are going to be moving because we're closing on the house tomorrow. So we'll be moving, I think, in a couple of weeks. So I just want to have some videos up for you guys um, so you don't think I abandoned you while we're moving. So I hope you enjoyed this plan with me. If there's anything, if you want me to do these in the future, please let me know because... You know, they're fun and they're different, and I like to incorporate, you know, different content on my channel. But I think that's going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will talk to you all in my next one. Have a good day. Bye.